What's up everybody? In this episode of the basement finishing series, I'm going to give you my best tips and tricks for installing drywall in your basement so you can get a result that looks like this. Before we can install drywall, we need to insulate in front of the basement, which we did in the previous videos. Now, you have standard drywall and your mold resistant drywall, which is green, and I always mark the outlet box locations before hanging the drywall so I can cut it out easily with a router. Use drywall screws to fasten the drywall to the studs, and if you're working alone, you can use a temporary screw as a second set of hands. You can cut out the window penetrations with a jab saw and a straight edge. Use a drywall lifting tool to get it flush with the piece above, and to cut drywall, use a straight edge and a utility knife to score and snap along the line. Then, secure it in place just like before. You can cut around vents with a router and then it's time to tape the seams with, with joint compound and drywall tape. You're going to do this for all the seams and the inside corners and then make sure you go back and get the screw heads. Then for the outside corners you're going to use something called corner bead. Let that dry then go back and apply your finish coats with a 10 inch and 12 inch knife. Sand everything down and once it looks good you're going to go ahead and prime and paint the walls. And here's a look at the final result. 